I'm out here in the cold to learn about one of the most famous birds in North America, the Northern Cardinal. It's a common sight in our backyard bird feeders, but it's a very special bird because it's able to survive in cold conditions like this on its own, unprotected. So let's learn more about what makes the Northern Cardinal able to survive the winter. One of the key ways cardinals survive the winter is by storing energy. During the fall, cardinals will build up their fat reserves by eating more than usual. Cardinals generally don't migrate, but stay where they are throughout the year. This stored energy provides the fuel they need to get through the cold winter months. Cardinals are able to maintain a high metabolic rate even in the coldest temperatures. Also like me, northern cardinals are able to regulate their body temperature by shivering. Their metabolism allows them to continue to search for food and generate heat even when the temperature drops. Another way cardinals survive the winter is by fluffing up their feathers. By doing this, they trap a layer of air close to their bodies, which helps to insulate them and keep them warm. Finally, cardinals are able to survive the winter by becoming less territorial. They stop defending their territory and may even roost together with other cardinals for warmth. They are able to conserve heat and protect each other from the elements. So there you have it. Cardinals are truly remarkable birds. They use a combination of strategies, from storing food to roosting together, to survive the harsh winter months. And the best part? We can help them by providing properly maintained bird feeders in our own backyards. Thanks for coming out to learn with me. You can keep learning by subscribing. You can also support this channel on Patreon or as a channel member. Thanks for stopping by to learn what makes life awesome.